This conference will now be recorded. All right. So I hope my screen is visible to everyone and the screen uh, and the voice is audible. Can just a few of you confirm in the chat box? All right, perfect. Uh, so we will just start in another five minutes. Okay, let's just wait for everyone to join in and then we'll just start in another two or three minutes. Okay. All right, all right, that's great. Uh, yeah, we'll just start in another two minutes, Deepak. I hope uh, the voice is on. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, so I guess since most of you have already joined in and we will just get started with the today's session. So uh, today's topic is going to be how do we predict the trend before it forms using Anchor Viva. So it's a new way of approaching the markets because we are predicting something before it is even forming, right? So before we start with today's session, I would just like to tell a little bit about myself. You know, most of you who are here, they already know me since I am part of multiple WhatsApp groups and also quite active on my socials. So my name is Riyan Karoda and I'm 23 years old. I'm based out of Jaipur, Rajasthan and currently I'm in third year of my graduation. I'm pursuing BA honors in economics. I have a little over nine years of experience in the market. I started when I was 14 years old and uh, since then I have learned a lot about technical analysis and that's just the knowledge which I believe that whatever I have learned, I should always give it back to the community. So I have trained a little over 1000 plus people so far and have conducted over 50 plus webinars since the start of my journey. So I have uh, attained these four certifications. If you talk about a little on the uh, a bit on the education side. So I have the research analyst certification. I have the investment advisor level one and level two. And I also have the equity derivatives certification. So uh, that is just my contact number and email number. So yeah, that is just a small intro about myself and uh, okay. So about today's topic, there is a small story that is aligned to today's topic. So uh, when I was a kid, when I was 15 or 16 years old and I used to trade in my dad's account. Okay. So my dad, he always used to ask me one thing that let's say you are buying a stock at hundred, right? And it is going till 120 and then it is coming down to 110. So why don't you sell it at 120 and buy it back at 110, right? That is always a question in everyone's mind. Like you are buying a stock at 100, it is going till 120. 
so 120 per we will sell and one when it comes back to 110 i will buy it back right so i always used to fight with him on this topic and uh, i used to say that it is impossible to predict that the stock will top out at 120 and it will reverse from 110 right because it is practically impossible to sell at the top and buy at the bottom that's what we always believed since you know that's just a thing so uh, when i spent more years in the market and you know i discovered this side of technical analysis and charts i realized that it is not impossible to predict right it is not impossible to predict this particular thing there is some amount of probability and there are several other things in technical analysis which can help us predict and analyze where a stock can potentially top now why we use the word potentially is because we cannot predict certainty right we cannot predict anything with 100% surety there is always some bit of probability or some bit of chances that what we are saying might happen or might not happen so that that is where the word potentially comes from so uh, the word potentially indicates probability not certainty because you know as technical analysts we believe in probabilities not certainties so to predict something with certainty is still i believe a myth right and it cannot happen in the stock market you know as investor vijay kd also says only two people can buy at the bottom and sell at the top one is god another one is a liar so we can just predict something based on probabilities and as technical analyst you know i personally who love charts we cannot say something with certainty that yes this will definitely happen right we cannot say that we can say that this can happen we cannot say this will happen we can say this can happen but over time just as we have our analysis for confidence aata we start to turn that word can into should right this can happen ka this should happen ho jata hai and as over time we gain more confidence then that this should happen also turns into this will happen kyunki but this will happen certainly comes after you know long period of experience and years you have spent in the market so that's just a belief and uh, that's just a small storyline which is aligned to today's topic so uh, to predict the potential top we have done a session earlier okay so i have uh, done about like 23 or 25 odd sessions in the past and i have posted the google drive link of that in multiple groups you know wherever you have got this link from so session number 3 11 12 21 and 22 of this google drive had all uh, the sessions which were related to to predict the potential top now i will also plan another session on the similar fund the similar topic which is how do we predict the potential top we will plan this on next weekend right and uh, to revise the session and i will just explain it in a more simplified manner so that is just on how do we predict the potential top particular kind of thing right but today's topic is something else right today's topic is that we are predicting the trend before it is forming using anchor view app right we are predicting the trend before it is forming uh, with anchor view app i don't have google drive link okay you don't have to worry about if you don't have the google drive link you will get the uh, google drive link at the end of the session okay so today's topic is going to be how do we predict the trend before it forms using anchor view app right so whatever you know whenever we start any session it is very very important to understand the topic right ki hamara jo topic hai ye kya bol raha hai so first of all what i'll do is i will break down this term right i will break down today's topic for each one of you that what does predicting the trend before it forms using av map actually means okay so the key words in this topic as you can very very clearly see is the first word is predicting the second word is trend the third word is before it forms and the fourth word is anchor view map right so main yahi char word hai jin pe humko focus karna hai so what we'll do is we will break down this title and we will understand that what we are really going to learn today right because it is very very important to understand the meaning of the basic terms first so today's topic if you just break it down the first word is predict right so what is predicting predicting is that uh, uh, the word predict means to say that something will happen in future right or to declare or indicate in advance so in the world of technical analysis and with charts we predict something based on probability of our analysis theek hai to koi cheez future mein hone wali hai usko hum predict karte hain pehle se hum andaaza lagate hain ki ha ye cheez future mein ho sakti hai so that is the meaning of the word 
प्रेडिक्ट और द वर्ड प्रेडिक्टिंग नाउ द सेकंड वर्ड इज ट्रेंड राइट ट्रेंड क्या होता है सो ट्रेंड इज बेसिकली द डायरेक्शन दैट प्राइसेस आर मूविंग इन बेस्ड ऑन वेयर दे हैव बीन इन द पास्ट ठीक है तो बेसिकली स्टॉक मार्केट में जो मेन ट्रेंड होते हैं वो दो टाइप के होते हैं ना सम पीपल विल से तीन टाइप के होते हैं बट अभी हम दो टाइप की बात करते हैं एक होता है अप ट्रेंड और एक होता है डाउन ट्रेंड ओके सो देयर आर प्राइमरीली टू टाइप्स ऑफ ट्रेंड इन द स्टॉक मार्केट वन इज एन अप ट्रेंड वन इज अ डाउन ट्रेंड नाउ द थर्ड वन इज अ साइडवेज ट्रेंड इन दैट द प्राइसेस दे मूव बोथ एंड्स बट वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू कवर दैट पार्ट ऑफ राइट नाउ सो प्राइमरीली देयर आर टू ट्रेंड्स इन मार्केट वन इज अप ट्रेंड एंड वन इज डाउन ट्रेंड सो व्हाट हैपेंस इन एन अप ट्रेंड इज दैट द स्टॉक मूव्स इन अ हायर हाई हायर लो फॉर्मेशन एंड व्हाट हैपेंस इन अ डाउन ट्रेंड इज दैट stock moves in a lower high and lower low formation okay so for a trend to form you know many people they get confused that you know uh, if i'm seeing a trend when do i think that it is in a higher high higher low formation or when do i think that is in a lower high lower low formation so there is a just a tip which i particularly use now you know i have conducted a session on this topic also in the past that is session number 2 of that google drive link so uh, you just need to get two red candles two lower closing red bars in an uptrend to form and two higher closing green bars in an downtrend to form to get a potential swing low or a swing high you know i have discussed in you know very very fine details on that google drive link in session number 2 so if you uh, guys want to understand like in more detail about the trend how trend is formed and how do we define those swing lows and swing highs you can very very clearly cover up that session right after this session ends okay so the uh this is just how you know an uptrend looks like so you can very very clearly see that this is the start of deepak night right here uh you can see the stock was trading somewhere around 886 then it went to 941 then it came down till somewhere around uh how much is this i don't know you can very very see it it is making new highs 941 banaya pehle then 1086 banaya then 1690 banaya then 1750 and then 1988 and on the lower side it is 941 1428 1533 1700 1712 so this is a clear indication that you can very very clearly see that ye jo highs hai these are the highs so the highs are increasing right which means we are getting higher highs 1086 mila then we got 1690 which is higher than 1086 then we got 1750 which is higher than 1690 then we got 1988 which is higher than 1750 so we are getting higher highs and we are also getting higher lows as you can very very see 1428 which is higher than 941 1533 which is higher than 1428 right so we are getting higher highs and we are also getting higher lows so this is a definition of uptrend when we are getting higher highs and we are getting higher lows and a definition of downtrend classic example yes bank we are getting 132 98 85 79 53 and 29 so we are getting classic lower lows and we are also getting lower highs you can very very clearly see pehle 157 bana fir 108 bana fir 75 bana right so we are getting lower highs and we are getting lower lows so this is a classic definition of a downtrend how a downtrend looks like okay uh the screen is visible guys i hope kisi ko bhi confusion ho can you just confirm in the chat box if the screen is visible i think some people are facing issues in seeing the screen okay perfect so uh, we were talking about downtrend and this is how a typical downtrend looks like okay now we will just go forward and break the third term so the third term is predicting the trend before it forms now what does before it forms means so before it forms means that koi bhi cheez banne se pehle hum usko predict kar rahe hain ki ha ye aise banegi ye aise ban sakti hai right so that is called before it forms that before means earlier than time or an event mentioned so trend formation takes place as a stock makes higher highs and higher lows right you very very uh, clearly know by now looking at these charts that agar stock uh, agar stock 1086 ja raha hai aur 941 aa raha hai and jab wo naya high bana raha hai tabhi to uptrend ban raha hai right so we are predicting 
uh, a trend before it forms. So before it forms indicate that we are predicting the trend before it actually establishes, right? We will learn more about this in a detail on the next slide. So now predicting the trend before it forms. We have three terms in three terms. Now we have the entire statement. Abhi, right? So the word predicting itself shows that it is aligned to probability or a possible vertical. Right? It is aligned to probability and we are just predicting something. We are not saying it out of certainty. If the stock is 100 to 120, then it will reverse. We are not saying that 110 will reverse. Hoga. We are saying that 110 से possibly reverse हो सकता है, okay? So that is the difference between saying something with certainty and saying something with probability. So predicting the trend before it forms in practical knowledge looks something like this. So uh, okay. So predicting the trend before it actually forms it looks something like this. What we'll do is we'll go to the our trading view terminal. And we will understand that what we are really trying to learn today. Okay. So, uh, okay. So, I hope screen is visible once again. No issues. Are you able to see the screen? I am on my trading view terminal right now. Okay. Perfect. Uh, so, what we are really trying to predict here is that you know let's just uh, let's just take into consideration two examples okay let's say there is one stock uh, stock stock name is a okay and there is one stock stock name is b okay so for the uh, stock number a let's say it has moved from 100 to 110 okay so now my dad used to ask me that how how will you predict that ki 110 pe top out ho jayega और 110 से ये नीचे आके कितना नीचे आएगा कि वहां से ये रिवर्स हो जाए राइट सो व्हाट वी आर ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट इन टुडे सेशन इज दैट लेट्स से अ स्टॉक हैज मूव्ड फ्रॉम 100 टू 110 नाउ फ्रॉम दैट 110 लेवल हाउ मच कैन द स्टॉक पोटेंशियली कम डाउन एंड रिवर्स फ्रॉम दैट पॉइंट टू मेक अ न्यू हाई राइट सो वी आर प्रेडिक्टिंग दिस पॉइंट व्हिच लेट्स से इज एक्स दिस पॉइंट नंबर एक्स ओके so for uh, let's say for stock number B, uh, the stock name B, let's say it has come down from 100 to 90. So we are predicting that from 90, how much the stock can go potentially up, right? And reverse from there to make a new low, right? So we are trying to predict the point number X once again here, right? So you understood, right? What we are trying to predict here. We are trying to predict that koi bhi stock 100 say 110 gaya. So, how much reverse can it go down and make a new high from 110? Right? In Hindi, we will say like that. And if a stock goes from 100 to 90, how much reverse can it go down and make a new low from 90? So, we are predicting these two things for a stock A, which we can see will be in an uptrend. And for stock B, which will, uh, which will be in a downtrend. Okay. So, this is what we are trying to predict. Okay, and now how we will be doing that? We will be doing that using Anchor Weaver. Okay, now what is happening here? a question that will come here. I am very very sure this end of session will come. That you know, these things, you know, which I am talking about predicting, these can be predicted also using moving averages, Fibonacci. Right, थोड़े बहुत लोगों को जिनको technical analysis की side पे थोड़ी knowledge होगी, वो मेरे को बोलेंगे at the end of session that these things can also be predicted using moving averages. These things can also be predicted using Fibonacci's and these things can also be predicted using pivot points. Right. So why don't you use them instead? Right. So I will answer this question as we go and learn about VWAP and AVWAP first. ठीक है तो VWAP और AVWAP दो चीजें होती हैं एक होता है वॉल्यूम वेटेड एवरेज प्राइस एक होता है एंकर्ड वॉल्यूम वेटेड एवरेज प्राइस इन दोनों चीजों के बारे में अभी हम यू नो वी विल जस्ट गो फॉरवर्ड एंड वी विल लर्न अबाउट देम सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट टू मेक इट क्लियर आई होप एवरीवन हैज गॉट दैट व्हाट वी आर रियली ट्राइंग टू लर्न एंड व्हाट वी आर रियली ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट हियर ओके जस्ट कंफर्म मी इन द चैट बॉक्स इफ यू हैव अंडरस्टूड दैट व्हाट वी आर ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट एंड लर्न फ्रॉम आवर टुडे सेशन Okay, perfect, perfect. Cool. Uh, so we'll just go to our screen and uh, 
we will see what is VWAP and AVWAP. Okay, so what we have done so far is that we have broken down uh, we have broken down our today's topic and we have understood the meaning of uh, crappy is that just one minute. And we have understood the meaning of this particular line, which is predicting the trend before it forms. Okay. So, this line ka matlab humne abhi tak samaj liya. And now the only thing remaining is that using VWAP. Now, we VWAP ko use karke hum kaise predict kar rahe hai, cheez, This we will uh, go forward and we will learn. Okay. So, let me just move on to the next slide. Just one minute. Okay, so uh, what is VWAP and AVWAP, right? Before we use any particular tool, we need to really know that ye VWAP, AVWAP, akhir hota hai, right? What is VWAP and what is AVWAP? So VWAP basically means volume weighted average price. The volume weighted average price is a measurement that shows the average price of a security adjusted for its volume. Okay, now the line adjusted for its volume is very, very important here, right? This will answer your question that why I don't use moving averages, Fibonacci's or pivot points. You know, in moving averages, in Fibonacci's and in pivot points, there is no role of volume, right? And being a price action trader, being, uh, being a firm believer of price volume analysis, I believe that, you know, there are two things that drive a particular stock price, right? Uh, there is just, you know, uh, there are two things that drive a particular stock price. One is the stock price itself and one is the volume which comes along with that. So volume is a driving source of any particular stock, right? The stock ka price hota hai, usko kya drive karta hai? Usko volume drive karta hai. Okay. So being a firm believer of price volume analysis, I honestly believe that, you know, uh, volume is this one minute. Right. So volume is very, very important when conducting any kind of analysis. And that is one reason why I don't like using moving averages. I don't use Fibonacci's as such to predict this particular thing, to predict the trend before it forms. To predict the trend before it forms, I usually like to use the anchor VWAP. So we understand that VWAP or AVWAP hota hai. Okay, what is VWAP and what is AVWAP? So volume weighted average price is a measurement that shows the average price of a security adjusted for its volume. So VWAP is dynamic. Okay, it forms each day from 9.15 a.m. So VWAP ka formula kya hota hai? VWAP ka formula hota hai? Summation of price times volume divided by summation of volume. And the price here is high plus low plus close divided by 3. So this is just a formula of VWAP. You don't really have to bother about the formula when you have, uh, you know, beautiful terminal like trading view with you. You don't really need to care about the formulas here, right? So what we'll do is uh, we'll just quickly show you how can you plot VWAP on the chart, right? Even though it does not have any significance with today's session, but it's just important and you should know that how do you plot uh, volume weighted average price on the chart. So let's just take any example. Let's say uh, we will plot, you know, my favorite script chart here, Adani Vilmar. So how do you plot VWAP? You just go to indicator section, right? You type here volume weighted average price, which is VWAP. And then, then you can uh, very, very clearly see a technical section mein, sabse pehla aata hai, which is volume weighted average price. I have star marked it, but if you haven't, then you will see it like this, right? So you just need to click on VWAP and then it will be plotted on your chart. Now you can very, very clearly see that on the daily chart, a VWAP typically looks like it is sticking to the price. And why does that happen? That happens because the VWAP is plotted from 9.15 a.m. of each candle. So just sawa no baje se jo average price hoti hai adjusted for its volume that is plotted on the chart, right? And that is once again adjusted every day from 9.15 a.m. So what you have to do is in case you are using VWAP for your whatsoever study or whatsoever analysis, you just go to settings here, right? And you hide this particular band because you are not concerned about the band. You are just concerned about the volume weighted average price line, which is this blue line. So you can very, very clearly see that 9.15 a.m. is my first candle, there is a VWAP plot. Hota hai. Okay. So if it is 7th October, the reference candle for VWAP is this particular candle, which is 9.15 a.m. candle. If it is 6th October, the reference candle is this candle. So it is mm -hmm. dynamic in nature, right? The reference point keeps on changing to the 9.15 a.m. opening candle in volume weighted average price. Now, the difference between VWAP and AVWAP, 
देखो एक होता है वीवैप एक होता है एवी वैप तो इन दोनों में डिफरेंस क्या होता है वन थिंग विच इज कॉल्ड ए वी वैप इट इज कॉल्ड एंकर्ड वी वैप राइट इट इज कॉल्ड एंकर्ड वॉल्यूम वेटेड एवरेज प्राइस सो द डिफरेंस बिटवीन दीज टू थिंग्स इज दैट वी वैप इज डायनामिक एंड ए वी वैप इज स्टैटिक राइट हाउ ए वी वैप इज स्टैटिक ए वी वैप गेट स्टैटिक इन अ वे दैट वी डिफाइन द रेफरेंस पॉइंट ठीक है तो अभी जैसे हम ये वाले चार्ट पे आ जाते हैं विच इज दिस चार्ट ऑफ अदानी विलमार देर इज नो रीजन टू टेक फाइव मिनट चार्ट there is no reasoning to take 5 minute chart you can take it on any chart it was just to you know make you understand that how vwap works and what is the reference point kahan se shuru hota hai vwap har din theek hai so every day when 9:15 am the market opens that from that candle the stock starts to take the weighted average price adjusted for its volume okay that is called vwap okay and what is avwap in avwap what you do is you define any particular reference candle and that stays to be fixed a farak kya ho raha hai farak ye ho raha hai ki maan lo uh, i want to see the volume weighted average price from this particular candle right then i will plot anchor wave wave from this candle because what happens is jaise hi mera next day shuru ho raha hai to meri jo reference candle hai volume weighted average price mein wo change hoke ye ho jayegi right and i am concerned about the volume weighted average price from this candle I don't want it from this candle, right? I want to know that यहाँ से जो stock में buying आई है volume के adjust होके, right? The buying which has come in the stock adjusted for its volume from this particular point, right? I want to see how it is playing out on the next day as well. I'm not interested in seeing that how the buying or selling will play out from this candle. And if that's the case, I am not interested in volume weighted average price. I am interested in anchored volume weighted average price. so that is just a difference between the two that ho kya raha hai 9:00 baje ki candle vwap har din le raha hai right 6th october ki 9:00 wali candle le li usne reference ke liye then agla din hua to agle din ki 9:00 wali candle le li usse pichle wala din tha to pichle wale din ki le li thi 9:00 right so the reference point is changing in that case but in anchor vwap so let me just show you how do you plot anchor vwap on the chart right how do you plot anchor vwap on the chart i will just very very quickly show you so you can see this is a trading view terminal which you know most of traders and investors they use for charting and technical analysis okay so how do you plot anchor vwap on this chart yaar mm-hmm. dekho ek cheez main aap sabko abhi bol deta hu broker ke terminals ke chart par rely mat karna okay don't use your broker terminals for any charts don't use zeros or don't use up stocks don't use fires don't you as if theek hai you have this beautiful terminal with you which is tradingview.com just use this website and it is more than enough to you know Uh, do all the technical analysis and charts and studies of so how do you plot anchor wave you just click on this trend line you can see this trend line here you just double click on this and then a panel will open up in the side so you will see anchored wave app at the bottom of this point so you just click on anchored wave app and whatever reference candle you want to take let's say you know uh, any person he wants to say that yaar stock yahan tak niche aaya tha the stock came low till 708 and from the levels of 708 it went till 761 right quite one way gaya na hai na that's quite a lot of buying here so let's say he wants to know that from 708 what was weighted average price adjusted for its volume the word volume plays a very very key role here right so let's say a person is interested in knowing this right then what he'll do is he will go to the anchor view app he will click on anchor view app and then he will select this particular candle jis pe 708 ka low bana tha now see the thing with anchor view app is that it is not plotting from any price level theek hai to isme aapko ye tension lene ki zarurat nahi hai that you are selecting low or you are selecting high or you are selecting open or close right that does not concern us because what we are doing is we are plotting the av app which is a volume weighted average price from a particular candle we are not plotting it from a particular level okay that is the difference very very important difference we are plotting it from a candle not from a level just one minute i'll just write down we are plotting it from a candle not from a level so uh, if you plot it from low or open or close or high it will still be the same Okay, it will not have any impact on that. 
So you just select Anchor View app then and you select this level of 707. And once you select this level and you click on this, you will see the Anchor View app is getting plotted. Okay. So now you can see very very clear difference. What happened in this? We have defined the reference point and it has been defined. This is the low of 708, this particular candle. So the AVU app which is plotted from this level, we can double click on this and we can change the color to black. Okay, so now you can see the difference between the two. The VU app is changing the reference point every day. Every day it is plotted from Sava 9, which is this candle. Then if it is the next day, it is plotted from here. Right, but in Anchor VU app what is happening is that it is being plotted from this level only. And it is not changing its reference point again and again. Right. So once we have selected the point, it remains fixed, which means static. Okay. So this is the difference between VWAP and AVWAP. So you can see AVWAP is a bit more smoother also compared to VWAP, right? Clearly. And that is the difference between the two. That is how we are using AVWAP. Okay. So uh, where will we place the AVWAP? That's a question coming in. And usi pe ab hum jane wale, right? the next point is that only where will we place the AVWAP. Okay, so that was just to give you a bit understanding about VWAP hota kya hai and AVWAP kya hota hai. Right? Hume pehle pata hona chahi hai, koi bhi cheez agar hum padh rahe hai, to wo akhir hoti kya hai. Right? We should know what it is before we are putting it into any kind of practical use. Right? So that is just a definition of what is VWAP and what is AVWAP. I hope the concepts were clear. VWAP sab ko samaj aagaya hai, AVWAP sab ko samaj aagaya ho. I hope the uh, concept of VWAP and AVWAP is clear to all. Okay, uh, time frame koi sa bhi ho sakta hai. See, ab dekho yaar, ye jo time frame wala part hai na, ye wale time frame wale part aapko aage chal ke clear honge once we start to take examples. Right, right now I was just telling you the definition about VWAP and the definition about AVWAP. So if the definition part is clear, then we can go forward and learn more about AVWAP, right? So uh, that is just how we plot the AVWAP and uh, yeah, let's just move forward now. Okay, so this is VWAP and this is AVWAP, just a difference between the two, just a slide I took from a website called Teddytix, right? So VWAP is starting from the first candle of the day and AVWAP can start from any point, right? In this case, we have point here, so here is the whole plot. And VWAP is starting candle when the market opens, then it is the plot from there. Every day, every day the market opening price changes, then VWAP reference point is changed, right? So this is just a difference between the two. So uh, predicting the trend before it forms using AVWAP. So now what we have done is we uh, terms ka meaning samajliya. We have understood what does predicting the trend before it forms means and we have understood AVWAP. Now just the word which is remaining is using. So ab in sab cheezo ko hum use kaise karte hai to predict the market trend uh, before it forms. So now we know that what we are going to predict, right? We know what we are using to predict it. We just need to combine the knowledge and finally understand how we are doing it. But one important note here is that practice and experience will get you a hang of it, right? Uh, you won't be like you attended today's session and then you just go on charts and if it is not working one time, you'll be like, Are yaar, ye kaise diya? Ye to kaam hi aar hai, ye to chali nahi hai. right? So your mindset should not be that. So practice and experience will make you get a hang of it. And there are many pro tips which I will share as you start to practice it. And I will also share at the end of session, which will help you in your journey ahead as you practice this tool on a regular basis. So uh, how do we predict and what are we trying to predict? Right? Kaise karte hai isko? Ab ye ek hai. So we will get back to this particular slide where I was telling you. So we will get back to the slide where I was telling you that what uh, we are trying to predict and how are we doing it. Now that we know what is Anchor VWAP, we just need to understand that how we are using that anchor VWAP to predict this point number X. I have starting that we are trying to point number X. Predict karne ki koshish kar rahe. Right? We are trying to predict that if a stock is 100 to 110, then 
तो वो 110 से कितना नीचे आके रिवर्स होके नया हाई बनाएगा राइट वी आर ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट दैट पॉइंट राइट सो हाउ आर वी प्रेडिक्टिंग दिस पॉइंट नंबर एक्स इट इज वेरी वेरी सिंपल बट उस पॉइंट पे जाने से पहले मैं मेरा एक पॉइंट मिस हो गया था तो यहाँ पे होता क्या है यहाँ पे जब भी हम लेट मी ओपन वन मोर डुप्लीकेट सो यहाँ पे व्हाट हैपेंस इज वेन एवर यू नो पीपल दे प्लॉट एंकर वी वैप देर इज जस्ट वन थिंग लेट से हमने एंकर वी वैप क्लिक किया और कोई भी कैंडल से यहाँ पे प्लॉट कर दिया तो एंकर वी वैप डज नॉट प्लॉट लाइक दिस यू नो द डिफॉल्ट सेटिंग्स आर समथिंग लाइक दिस सो वेन यू प्लॉट द एंकर वी वैप यू विल सी अ लॉट ऑफ बैंड अराउंड इट राइट एंड दैट माइट कंफ्यूज यू दैट यार रियांग ने जब सेशन में प्लॉट किया था तो उसके तो इतने सारे बैंड्स आ नहीं रहे थे यहाँ पे मेरे बैंड्स क्यों आ रहे हैं इतने सारे राइट वॉट डू आई डू विद सो वॉट यू नीड टू डू इज वंस यू हैव प्लॉटेड एंकर वी वैप राइट एक बार इसको डिलीट कर देता हूँ वंस यू हैव प्लॉटेड एंकर वी वैप फ्रॉम एनी कैंडल एंड यू आर गेटिंग सो मेनी बैंड अराउंड इट वॉट यू नीड टू डू इज यू जस्ट नीड टू डबल क्लिक ऑन दिस एंकर वी वैप यहाँ पे ऐसे एक दो डबल क्लिक करो और डबल क्लिक करते ही एक पैनल ओपन हो जाएगा राइट वंस दिस पैनल इज ओपन यू जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दिस दिस एंड दिस यू डोंट नीड दीज थ्री थिंग्स ठीक है ये तीन चीजों की आपको रिक्वायरमेंट नहीं है सो यू डोंट नीड दीज थ्री थिंग्स यू जस्ट हाइड दम अप एंड देन यू विल बी गुड टू गो सो दैट जस्ट वन पॉइंट आई वॉन्ट टू मेक बिकॉज आफ्टर द सेशन आई वॉज श्योर आई वॉज श्योरली गोइंग टू गेट दिस क्वेश्चन दैट यू नो आई एम गेटिंग लॉट ऑफ बैंड अराउंड इट हाउ डू आई हाइड दीज हाउ डू आई हाइड दीज सो जस्ट क्वेश्चन आई क्लैरिफाइड वेल इन एडवांस ठीक है सो यू नीड टू हाइड दीज बैंड बिकॉज यू आर नॉट कंसर्न विद दम यू आर जस्ट कंसर्न अबाउट द एंकर्ड वॉल्यूम वेटेड एवरेज प्राइस विच इज दिस ब्लैक लाइन right you can change the color going in the style though style mein jaake you can change the color of the view app and you can just make it a bit you know thicker or whatever color suits you okay so that's just it that's just how you you know hide the bands okay so now getting back to it we are trying to predict the point number x right so how we are trying to predict the point number x that is now going to be the very very important thing ab dekho yaar kuch bhi nahi sahi bhi batao kuch bhi nahi hai people have made it very very complex and uh, you know it is very very simple what you need to do is you need to plot an anchor wave map from this 100 theek hai ek anchor wave map yahan 100 se plot karna hai aur wo jo anchor wave map plot hoga wo something aisa hoga theek hai wo something aisa hoga right and this anchor wave map will likely fall somewhere around this level x राइट right. और अगर हम डाउन ट्रेंड में स्टॉक को ये एक्स लेवल प्रिडिक्ट कर रहे हैं तो यहाँ से एक एंकर व्यू है प्लॉट करना है एंड दैट विल लुक समथिंग लाइक दिस ओके सो इट इज वेरी वेरी सिंपल यू जस्ट हैव टू प्लॉट वन एंकर व्यू एप फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर पॉइंट विच इज पॉइंट नंबर हंड्रेड ठीक है नाउ यू नो अभी अगर हम कभी भी ऐसे समझते हैं चीजों को तो वो ढंग से हमें समझ नहीं आती राइट right? हमको हमेशा एग्जाम्पल लेके समझना चाहिए एग्जाम्पल से वी विल गेट अ बेटर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ हाउ वी आर डूइंग इट एंड व्हाट पॉइंट्स आर वी टेकिंग एज द स्टॉक मूव फॉरवर्ड क्योंकि यार देखो ऑब्वियसली बात है अभी ये स्टॉक ने जब नया हाई बना दिया यहाँ पे लेट से 110 के बाद इसने 115 बना दिया यहाँ पे राइट सो इट इज प्रेटी ऑब्वियस दैट हंड्रेड से भी स्टॉक नीचे आएगा राइट हंड्रेड से भी नीचे आएगा तो वो फ्रॉम हंड्रेड हाउ मच लो विल इट कम and from there it will reverse to make a new high in that case our reference point will change from 100 to point number x theek okay? hai so this we will understand as we start to go forward and take some more examples abhi hum ek cheez aur dekhenge mai ko bas pata nahi ki that i honestly feel that the best way to learn anything new right if you are learning anything new in the market then it is uh, you know best to start with the least data available जितना कम डेटा आपके पास स्टार्ट पे होगा यू विल गेट वेरी वेरी लेस कंफ्यूज ठीक है कंफ्यूजन उतना कम हो जाएगा तो हम क्या करेंगे हम आज ये वाली कंपनी उसके एग्जांपल लेंगे ओके नॉट नॉट ऑल ऑफ देम जस्ट अ फ्यू ऑफ देम वी विल टेक एग्जांपल्स ऑफ दिस एंड वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ वी आर ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट दैट पॉइंट नंबर x ओके सो लेट्स टेक फॉर द टाइम बीइंग लेट्स स्टार्ट विद एन एग्जांपल ऑफ अदानी विलमार ओके दैट इज द एग्जांपल नंबर 1 राइट वी विल टेक ऑन अदानी विलमार Okay, so this is the chart. Now what we'll do is we'll just go backdate. We will just go backdate here. ठीक है? तो हम क्या करते हैं? इसको यहाँ तक कर देते हैं एक बार. Okay, now listen to me very very carefully because what you have learned so far from the session, you will learn ten times more if you listen to me very very carefully in the example side. 
एक बार ये एग्जाम्पल की साइड से समझ आ गया तो प्रैक्टिकल नॉलेज पूरी क्लियर हो जाएगी एंड इफ यू आर क्लियर ऑन द प्रैक्टिकल नॉलेज पार्ट यू विल बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट वॉट एंड हाउ यू आर सपोज टू डू थिंग्स ओके सो वट वील डू इज वी विल जस्ट प्लॉट द चार्ट ऑफ अदानी विलमार फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर पॉइंट लेट से द स्टॉक वेंट वन टू थ्री फोर ऊपर ऊपर जाता गया राइट right? तो जो स्टॉक का लो था यहाँ पे कितना था एक बार मैं मार्क कर देता हूँ प्राइस लेवल या सो द लो ऑफ द स्टॉक हेयर वॉज टू हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी सेवन ओके एंड देन दाई ऑफ फोर हंड्रेड एंड नाउ अब ये वाले एग्जाम्पल में अगर आप देखो ये वाले को मैं अगर हटा देता हूँ बीच में राइट right. सो so, यहाँ पे अगर आप दोनों चीजों को कंपेयर करो एक बार के लिए उस वाले पार्ट को हाइड कर दो सो वी आर सीइंग 227 का स्टॉक गया 419.90 इट इज वेरी वेरी सिंपल 100 का 110 गया राइट right? बिल्कुल सेम ही है तो अब हम प्रेडिट क्या कर रहे हैं कि 419 से स्टॉक कितना नीचे आएगा और वहां से रिवर्स होके नया हाई बनाएगा वी आर प्रेडिक्टिंग दैट फ्रॉम द लेवल ऑफ फोर हाउ मच विल द स्टॉक कम डाउन एंड फ्रॉम देयर it will reverse to make a new high right so we are predicting this point number x right we are predicting this and how we are doing it we are plotting an anchor we have from from which level are we plotting the anchor we have in this case tell me in the chat box Two twenty-seven. Yes, that is absolutely right. We are plotting it from the level of two hundred and twenty-seven, right? So we are plotting an anchor. We are from two twenty-seven. अभी यहाँ पे एक question मेरे को लग रहा है आ सकता है बहुत लोगों का that यार रियांक you said stock moved from two twenty-seven to four hundred nineteen point ninety, right? How do you define four hundred nineteen point ninety as the high? तो मैं कैसे पता ये 419.90 से ही रिवर्स होके नीचे आना शुरू होएगा, राइट हाउ डू यू नो फ्रॉम 419.90 इट विल कम लो एंड कैन मेक अ स्विंग लो राइट सो नाउ द आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज वेरी वेरी क्लियर आई डोंट नो राइट आई डोंट नो दैट इट विल रिवर्स फ्रॉम 419.90 एंड इट विल मेक अ स्विंग लो सो देर आर कंडीशन फॉर स्विंग लो कि हम स्विंग लो को रिकॉर्ड कब करते हैं द सेशन नंबर टू ऑफ लर्निंग इनिशिएटिव द गूगल ड्राइव लिंक विच आई है ठीक है तो ये डाउ थ्योरी से हमें पता चलता है कि कोई भी स्विंग लो कब बनेगा और वो पॉइंट को हम स्विंग लो कब रिकॉर्ड करते हैं राइट सो इट इज वेरी वेरी सिंपल आई विल जस्ट कवर इट राइट नाउ ऑल्सो लेट से फ्रॉम फोर हंड्रेड नाइनटीन पॉइंट नाइनटी ठीक है कोई भी कैंडल पे अगर हाई बन गया लेट से सम कैंडल मेक्स अ हाई Right, it makes 419.90 high. Now from there, I need two red candles fall. Right, and those two red candles should have lower closing. Now they can be either consecutive or sequential. Okay, so this is just going to be how we can potentially think of as a swing low. Right. So now here we see that 227 stock, 419. Point 90 तक चला गया, right? A stock went from 227 to 419.90, and now from 419.90 we are guessing how low it can come. We are predicting that particular level, right? We are predicting that particular level. No audio, please suggest audio clear to all guys. Just confirm in the chat box once. I'm not sure two people are saying audio is not clear. Also, just in case, guys, you are messaging on the chat box. You can just click to everyone, right, so that everyone can see in the chat box that if audio is clear to all. Just confirm in the chat box, guys, if the audio is clear. All right, perfect. Let's check here. Okay, so uh, from the level of four hundred nineteen point ninety, we are trying to predict that how low the Price can go and reverse to make a new high, right? For that, we are plotting an anchor we have from the level of 227. So we plotted an anchor we have from this level, and you can see right now it is coming at 316.60. So what we'll do is we will run this in the play mode, right? 
okay so one two let's just let's just the candles we formed okay so now you can see what has happened is that from the level of 419.90 ab ye wali candle pe meko 419.90 ka high mil gaya right i got a high of 419.90 on this candle and after getting a high i got two red candles fall one is this red candle and one is this red candle right so by now i know that a higher low or a potential higher low as we say potential higher low is in formation once after a stock has made a high and it has given me a two red candle fall and both those red candles are lower closing candle lower closing ka matlab kya hua ye wali red candle ki closing 383.85 hai next red candle closing is 377 so these both are lower closing candles right so i have got two red candles and both are lower closing candles so i know that a potential higher low which is x is in formation and this x we are trying to predict that is a higher low hai ye kahan pe banega right After, uh, by plotting an anchor we have from 227 so we plotted an anchor we have from this point and you can see the anchor we have right now is 328 so yahan pe agar maan lo main 17th feb ko bolunga to main bolunga mere ko lagta hai ye stock 328 around 328 it can reverse from around 328 it can reverse this is what i will say right let's see next day stock gaya wapas okay so two days passed and the avwap came to 329.45 ye jo black aapko dikh raha hai right side axis pe that is the avwap because it is black in color let me just make it a bit thicker also so that everyone can see so the avwap is at 329.45 and the price touched 327.60 right so avwap is at 329.45 so i can say stock can reverse from 329.45 राइट right. और स्टॉक ने ये वाले प्राइस को टच किया राइट इट्स अ हायर लो इट विल बी अ हायर लो इट विल बी अ पोटेंशियल हायर लो व्हाई विल इट बी अ पोटेंशियल हायर लो बिकॉज़ द स्टॉक है वो 227 से 419.90 तक गया राइट तो स्टॉक लो से हाई तक गया अब स्टॉक हायर लो बनाएगा तभी तो स्टॉक हायर हाई बनाएगा राइट right. तो जो स्टॉक है वो 227 से ऊपर लो बनाएगा राइट द लो दैट दिस पर्टिकुलर स्टॉक विल मेक इट विल बी अब 227 फॉर द स्टॉक टू गो इन एन अप ट्रेंड राइट इफ द स्टॉक हैज टू गो इन एन अप ट्रेंड इट हैज टू मेक अ लो हायर देन 227 एंड इट हैज टू मेक अ हाई हायर देन 419.90 राइट सो दैट इज व्हाई आई रेफर टू इट एज पोटेंशियल हायर लो how did you choose 227 and why i explained it here right when we are predicting a potential higher low when we are predicting that from where the stock can reverse and make a new high we are taking the 100 level which is jahan se journey start hui hai stock ki we are taking that point and we are plotting anchor we have from that level okay so we have plotted an anchor we have from 227 and you can see stock touch this level theek hai ab generally most of the cases right i am talking about most of the cases because i have used anchor we have since a very very long time in most of the cases what happens is that stock reverses from here and it makes a new high theek hai two cases hote hain right yahan pe i will discuss two cases that one if stock touches avwap avwap acts as a strong support second case is if stock touches avwap and the next candle gives green candle closing below avwap avwap is still acting as a strong support okay so until and unless we don't get a you know red candle closing which is subsequent below this avwap so what we generally take into consideration is that your jo avwap ka level hota hai na iske niche meko at least right meko if you are referring to the daily chart i need at least 1% closing below avwap level this these are just some pro tips right and if you are referring to weekly at 
एटलीस्ट टू परसेंट क्लोजिंग बिलो ए बी वैप लेवल अब ये दोनों केस में कैंडल जो क्लोज हो रही हो वो रेड कैंडल क्लोजिंग होनी चाहिए राइट ग्रीन कैंडल क्लोजिंग डज नॉट काउंट हेयर इफ यू आर गेटिंग ग्रीन कैंडल क्लोजिंग बिलो ए बी वैप इट इज एन इंडिकेशन दैट जो ए बी वैप का लेवल है वो स्ट्रॉन्ग सपोर्ट एक्ट करेगा बिकॉज यार कोई भी लेवल होता है ना तो वो लेवल नहीं होता वो एक पर्टिकुलर जोन होता है राइट इवन इन केस ऑफ ए बी वैप इट इज नॉट एनी काइंड ऑफ पर्टिकुलर लेवल कि हाँ स्टॉक विल रिवर्स फ्रॉम थ्री ट्वेंटी नाइन पॉइंट फोर्टी फाइव ओनली इट इज अ जोन अराउंड दैट प्राइस फ्रॉम वेयर द स्टॉक पोटेंशियली रिवर्स इज राइट सो राइट नाउ द लेवल इज थ्री ट्वेंटी नाइन पॉइंट फोर्टी फाइव सो हाउ वी stock can reverse we don't say will reverse because we are technical analyst and we don't believe in certainties we believe in probabilities how do you know it will make potential higher low it can form lower low and yes i don't know that it will make a potential higher low i'm just saying that it can make a potential higher low i'm not saying it will make a potential higher low right because being a technical analyst i'm believing in probability i'm not believing in certainty i'm saying that it can make a potential higher low uh, around this point and it can reverse from here to make a new high i'm not saying it uh, i'm not saying it will i'm saying it can okay so this is the level let's see how the next candle formed okay there you go we have come to the point where i was saying that agar av wap ke niche i am getting a green candle closing what i'll do is i'll just change the color from blue to green just in case people don't get confused so in case below av wap if we are getting a green candle closing that does not count as a that does not count that av wap is not acting as a strong support that counts as that av wap is still acting as a strong support right to ye wala jo zone hai around 329 this is still acting as a strong support for awn right and now what i say is that agar me ko ye green candle ki closing mil gayi hai av wap ke niche so now i will say that av wap is not acting as a strong support if we get a closing below 305 to ye jo 305 ka jo low ho jata hai this is important now if red candle closes below this i will say this is not acting as i will say av wap is not acting as support now okay so this level is going to be what i will be watching for i know bahut sare questions honge you know just keep the questions noted in a notebook yaar because agar hum saath saath questions lete chale gaye to session kafi lamba ho jayega and we won't be able to wind it up in time so what i'll do is i will just try to wind it up in another 10 15 minutes and in the remaining 20 minutes we will take all the remaining questions so this 305 level is going to be very very important now to watch out because we have got a green candle closing below the anchor wap level right so right now we are still saying that ye jo av wap hai 329 wala av wap is still strong support we don't say av wap we say av wap zone okay so from this level we are saying now we potentially believe That यहां से जो स्टॉक है ये रिवर्स होके नया हाई बनाएगा राइट एंड लेट सी नाउ हाउ दैट प्लेड आउट ओके there you go uh, the stock made a new high right and it reversed somewhere from that anchor we have level only which we potentially plotted right so that is how we are using anchor we have to predict the trend before it forms ab isme humne predict kya kiya humne ye predict kiya ki from the level of 419.90 how low the stock can come and reverse from those levels right so how low we said we said around 329.45 zone around this particular zone right so that is how we predicted the trend right now what we'll do is we will take one more example of a different stock let's take an example for campus activity this was also one of ipos which got listed very very recently back in may june 2022 right so in this case what happened was in this case the stock made a low theek hai to stock ne pehle यहाँ पे ये वाला पॉइंट बनाया एक सेकंड मैं जस्ट हाईलाइट कर देता हूँ 
okay so first stock had a high of 418 right then stock made a low of 314.50 right and then uh, so we had just this particular kind of picture right now like you know uh, one of our participants said that humko nahi pata ki yahan se stock kya banayega stock can make a new high also or stock can make you know what said right so what we are doing is we are defining the trend first राइट right. हम डिफाइन कर रहे हैं कि हुआ क्या प्राइस में अभी तक एक्शन हुआ क्या है हमारे पास राइट right. तो अभी तक हमारे पास क्या हुआ है अभी तक स्टॉक 418 से फ्रॉम द लेवल ऑफ 418 द स्टॉक हैज कम डाउन वी कैन क्लियरली सी 418 से द स्टॉक हैज कम टिल 314.50 राइट तो ये वाली जो लाइन हम बनाते हैं इसको हम कहते हैं बेस ट्रेंड दिस इज कॉल्ड बेस ट्रेंड फॉर्मेशन राइट इट इंडिकेट्स व्हाट कैन potentially happen right so if you talk in layman terms if a stock has come down from 418 to 314.50 what can potentially happen there is just one thing that can potentially happen that from 314.50 it will bounce it it will bounce par ye wala bounce wala criteria kab hoga ab mere ko chat box mein batao ye bounce wala criteria kab satisfy hoga when will we get a swing low uh, when will we get a swing high because we are referring to downtrend here in an uptrend we said that we will get a swing low when we get two red candles fall with both of the candles having lower closing but for a downtrend what is the case how many uh, green candles we want and what should be the criteria let's see in the chat box correct two green candles with higher closing that is going to be the criteria so from 314.50 uh, what we are assuming is that it will bounce and we will get two green candle with higher closing right and it will make a new low because that is a base trend formation abhi tak hua kya 418 se stock niche hi aaya right and from 314.50 we expect i am not saying we are saying that yahi hoga right अभी यार कई बार ऐसे भी होता है कि 314.50 से स्टॉक रिवर्स होके 410 के भी ऊपर निकल जाता है राइट right? 418 के भी ऊपर निकल जाता है बट आर बेस लाइन एजम्पन बेस्ड ऑन द फर्स्ट साइड ऑफ द ट्रेंड इज दैट फ्रॉम 314.50 इट विल बाउंस एंड मेक अ लोअर हाई टू मेक अ लोअर लो ओके सो दैट इज अजम्पन राइट नाउ यू कैन सी फ्रॉम थ्री it made a low at this candle right and then i got one green candle right iska color change kar deta hu fir se koi confusion now we got one green candle closing was 350 uh, 342 we got one more green candle closing was 343 right so we got two green bars both were with higher closing both are sequential both are not consecutive so consecutive ho ya sequential sequential matlab ki मतलब एक के बाद एक नई भी हो तो भी चलेगी राइट कॉन्सेक्यूटिव और सिक्वेंशियल डजेंट मैटर राइट सो वी गॉट वन एंड वी गॉट टू सो नाउ वी नो दैट देर इज अ पोटेंशियल हायर लो सॉरी अ पोटेंशियल लोअर हाई इन फॉर्मेशन एंड वी आर ट्राइंग टू प्रेडिक्ट दैट पोटेंशियल लोअर हाई एंड फॉर दैट वॉट रेफरेंस पॉइंट विल बी बी टेकिंग नो देर इज नो कंडीशन दैट वी डोंट नीड एनी रेड कैंडल बिटवीन सिक्वेंशियल ऐसी कोई कंडीशन नहीं है पुनीत ओके सो व्हाट रेफरेंस पॉइंट विल बी बी टेकिंग हियर टू प्रेडिक्ट द पोटेंशियल लोअर हाई फोर हंड्रेड एटीन दैट्स वी विल नॉट बी टेकिंग थ्री हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टीन वील जस्ट बी टेकिंग फोर हंड्रेड एटीन डोंट कंफ्यूज विद दैट सो वी आर टेकिंग फोर हंड्रेड एंड एटीन कैंडल एज अ रेफरेंस कैंडल सो वी आर प्लॉटिंग एन एंकर वी आर फ्रॉम दिस लेवल ठीक है तो ये हमने एक एंकर व्यू है प्लॉट कर दिया अब हम क्या करेंगे अब हम आगे चल के देखेंगे कि कैसे स्टॉक ने प्ले आउट किया राइट right. तो यहाँ पे द स्टॉक केम टिल दिस लेवल एंड इट टच द ए व्यू एप यहाँ पे इसने ए व्यू एप को टच किया यू कैन सी द ए व्यू एप वॉज एट थ्री सिक्सटी सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्सटी फाइव राइट अब मैंने क्या बात करी थी प्रो टिप क्या थी कि डेली के लिए हाउ मच परसेंटेज अब आई नीड क्लोजिंग अब ए व्यू एप One percent. That's right. 
So 1% of 366.65, how much is that? 366.65 plus 1% is 370.30. So I got 370.30 ke upar closing chahiye thi, but this green candle closed at 368. So this does not count as a valid uh, rejection or a valid criteria to falsify the effect of AVU app. So right now also the AVU app is a strong resistance. And you can see uske baad ek red candle ban gaya. So that just gave me more validation that yes, this anchor we have zone is acting as a good resistance zone. So then the stock continued to go down, right? And it made a, it made a new low, I guess. It made a low till the level of 297. So now you can see that it made a high of 374 and then it made a low of 297. So abhi hume ko batao. ये वाला आपको करंट ट्रेंड देख के व्हाट इज योर असेसमेंट 418 द स्टॉक मेड 314 314 स्टॉक बाउंस 374 एंड वी प्रेडिक्टेड दिस वी प्रेडिक्टेड दिस वी आर प्रेडिक्टिंग कि 314 से स्टॉक कितना बाउंस करेगा कि वहां से वो रिवर्स होके नया लो बनाए राइट एंड दिस इज अ वेरी वेरी क्लियर डाउन ट्रेंड राइट नाउ कम्स अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग पॉइंट that hota kya hai with time you can see what happened is that from 314 the stock made 374 and then stock made a new low of 297 right so now what will happen is that ye jo avwap humne plot kiya tha na the avwap which we had plotted from 418 this iska jo effect hai wo kam hona shuru ho jayega right the effect of this avwap the effect of avwap we plotted from 418 will start to get reduced or low after the stock has made a new low right you are understanding what i'm saying right so 418 se jo humne avwap plot kiya tha that avwap will have very very strong effect till the stock is above 314.50 Once the stock has made a new low below 314.50, can you guys tell me which AVWAP will play more role and have more strength? कौन से लेवल से हम AVWAP प्लॉट करेंगे फिर उसके बाद कि हाँ वो वाले लेवल से जो AVWAP है अब उसमें स्ट्रेंथ ज़्यादा होगी? Wow, we have a very very smart audience with us. The level will be 374.70. क्योंकि जो पहला राउंड था सेलिंग का दैट वाज फ्रॉम 418 टू 314 द नेक्स्ट राउंड ऑफ सेलिंग वाज फ्रॉम 374 टू 297 राइट सो द द एवी वैप विल शिफ्ट आफ्टर वी हैव गॉट अ न्यू लो तो ये न्यू लो बनते ही मेरा जो एवी वैप है वो मैं यहां से उठा के यहां पे ले आऊंगा व्हिच इज 374.70 तो मैंने एवी वैप यहां से प्लॉट कर दिया ओके okay. so this is going to be the case this is going to be ki ab kya hoga ab hum ye predict karenge ki 297 se stock kitna bounce karega aur bounce karke wo naya low banayega ya nahi right we will predict that from the level of 297.10 how much will the stock bounce and it will reverse from that particular level to make a new low below 297.10 okay so let's just go forward and see what happened so 297 the stock made a low and then it bounced it touched the avw app right avw app ko touch kiya avw app ke upar ek do ye do wick rejection diya right to yahan se mere ko do green candle bhi mil gayi right and i got a wick rejection also which is now the level of 336 i know will play a very very crucial role so you can see going forward the price started to move above this particular level however it could not give me a very very good closing राइट right. तो होता क्या है अभी आप जब मेरे यू नो आई हैव कंडक्टेड वेरी वेरी मेनी सेशंस इन द पास्ट वंस यू गो एंड यू सी अ फ्यू सेशंस व्हिच इज आई थिंक दो सेशन इसमें बहुत बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट होंगे यू गो एंड सी सेशन नंबर 21 एंड 22 या दीस टू सेशंस इफ यू गो एंड सी आफ्टर द एंड ऑफ सेशन यू विल अंडरस्टैंड दैट व्हाई आई गिव सो मच इंपॉर्टेंस टू क्लोजिंग ऑन द डेली चार्ट्स राइट तो अगर हम कोई भी छोटा टाइम फ्रेम यूज कर रहे हैं ना अगर हम 5 मिनट यूज कर रहे हैं इफ वी आर यूजिंग 15 मिनट then we don't really have to give importance to closing because we are dealing the markets from a traders point of view but if we are referring to daily weekly or monthly charts we give importance to closing a lot and that you will understand if you watch session number 21 and 22 after that session after this one 
right so this is going to be a one case and if we go back to that so what we see is that really lab ke upar ek wick rejection aaya dusra wick rejection aaya teesra wick chautha wick theek hai to ye jo wick rejections hote hain na above you know whatever particular points the stock is going this indicates that stock upar jaane ki koshish to kar raha hai the stock is trying to go up but it is refusing to sustain or at those levels and as technical analyst we believe this particular signs to be just a bit not convincing on our side theek hai so that is going to be the case ab ye wick you can see ek wick mili fir ek wick ke upar ek aur wick mil gayi right then above this wick also i did not get closing i got another wick then i got another wick right so this is just an indication that it is a not good sign and until and unless we do not get a closing above 342 now it will not be a valid reversal right so now going forward humko av wap ke upar aur wick ke upar yahan pe closing milti to ye closing milte hi matlab kya hua meaning was that the av wap resistance is now invalid right it means the stock can now reverse and potentially make a new high right you are understanding what i'm saying right because jab hum starting mein predict kar rahe the we were predicting that from the level of 374.40 the av wave we have plotted we were predicting that from this level the av wave that we have plotted that will face resistance and yahan se stock resistance face karke new low banayega hamari expectation ye thi right hamari expectation thi ki 297 se stock upar aayega av wave pe resistance face karega aur naya low banayega this was our expectation what happened is that stock av wave ke upar chala gaya aur stock ne av wave ke upar humko closing bhi de di the stock went above av wave and it also gave me a closing above that level now that indicates that there is strength in that stock it means the stock can now reverse i always use the word can i never use the term will the stock can now reverse and it can potentially make a new high now in case of reversals agar kabhi bhi humko av wave ke upar closing mil rahi hai in case of reversals what happens is okay so in case of reversals what we need to do is That अगर हम ये अज्यूम कर रहे हैं कि स्टॉक कैन मेक अ न्यू हाई इफ वी आर अज्यूमिंग नाउ स्टॉक कैन मेक अ न्यू हाई फ्रॉम वेयर शुड वी प्लॉट एन ए वी वैप एन मी इन दैट बॉक्स इफ वी आर नाउ अज्यूमिंग दैट फ्रॉम द लेवल ऑफ वट्स एवर फ्रॉम वेर एवर इट इज रिवर्सिंग फ्रॉम वी आर अज्यूमिंग दैट इट कैन मेक अ न्यू हाई फ्रॉम वेयर विल वी प्लॉट द ए वी वैप beautiful 297 is going to be the level from where we will plot another av wave so we plotted one av wave from 297.10 now okay and after we got a closing above this level let's say we went long on the stock theek hai 344 pe humne stock ko khareed liya theek hai now if we are going long in the stock at 344 this av wave will act as a very very strong support which we have plotted from 297.10 let me just change the color to blue Okay, just in case you are able to uh, differentiate between the two. So now, what we are assuming is that the stock will make a new high, and and whenever the stock comes down, the blue AV wave will play a crucial support. Okay, this is our assumption. So now let's see how the stock played out. The stock started to go up, up and up. It made a new high, which was our assumption, and it played out to be. amazing you can see the stock continued to go up up and up only and uh, then the stock started to come down a bit but once again now you can see ab yahan pe ek aur cheez wapas ho gayi aap dekhoge ki stock ne jab ye wala high banaya when the stock made a high of 459 it made a low of 404 to yahan pe wapas se jo mera purana av wave tha which was this blue av wave this will not have that much importance and strength and once again i will change this and i will not use this i will start to plot a new av wave from 404.30 right you are understanding how i am changing the av wave right 
जैसे जैसे स्टॉक एक हाई बना रहा है वहां से स्टॉक में को दो रेड कैंडल का फॉल दे रहा है राइट एंड फ्रॉम दैट लेवल आफ्टर मेकिंग दैट लेवल इट इज मेकिंग अ न्यू हाई तो न्यू हाई बनने के बाद आई एम चेंजिंग द एवी वेब टू फोर जब न्यू हाई बन गया ओनली देन आई एम चेंजिंग द एवी वेब बिफोर दैट आई एम यूजिंग द ओल्ड एवी वेब ओनली ओके तो नॉट टू कंफ्यूज यू विद दैट तो ये जब यहाँ पे न्यू हाई हमको मिल गया then we change this blue avi wave which was earlier from the level of 297 to the level of 404.30 right then you can see going forward jab jab stock niche aaya yahan pe ek bar stock niche aaya stock ne avi wave pe support liya right then uh, abhi yahan pe aap dekhoge yahan pe kya hua yahan pe bhi wahi hua fir ye high bana aur ye low ban gaya right to so anchor avi wave jab ye high ke upar naya high bana to anchor avi wave wapas change hoke yahan pe aa gaya राइट देन यू कैन वंस अगेन क्लियरली सी ये हाई बनने के बाद वापस जैसे ही एवी एफ यहाँ पे टच करता था हमेशा एक सपोर्ट लेता था एंड द सपोर्ट इज ऑलवेज बीइंग हेल्ड ऑन क्लोजिंग बेसिस दिस इज वन वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग ऑब्जर्वेशन यू शुड मेक दैट वेन द स्टॉक इज क्लोजिंग द स्टॉक इज ऑलवेज होल्डिंग दैट एवी एफ लेवल ऑन द क्लोजिंग बेसिस सो फॉर नाउ इफ यू रिमूव एवरी एंड यू सी द एवी एफ फ्रॉम दिस लेवल राइट नाउ यू नो दैट इस करेंट टाइम पे कैंपस एक्टिवियर का जो सपोर्ट है as per the anchor we have on closing basis it is a level of 500 right so that is just going to be what uh, the examples which i really wanted to take and this was just a bit of uh, from the example side okay so now what we'll do is we have 15 minutes we will just take up the questions and whatever pending doubts you have in mind theek hai examples ki side pe main kya karunga I think I will plan another session which will be completely on the example side, right? Pura examples ki side pe ek alag session rakhenge kyunki examples maine yaar koshish kari dekho do stocks liye aur jitna acche se I could have explained I did that. Okay, uh, so now let's just go forward and take the questions. Okay, so the first question is: AVI wrap resistance is breached when closes above one percent, or we get closing above the wick. Okay, that's an interesting question. So, yar, dekho, two cases hote hain. Abhi ye wale case mein agar hum consider karte hain, ek baar mein sab remove kar deta hu. Yahan se maine ek AVI wrap plot kiya tha, right? So let's say agar ye jo red candle thi, this red candle which had formed right here, you can see the AVI wrap was at 547. If the closing was one percent below this AVI wrap on this red candle, I would have exited, right? If 547.25 minus one percent closing was there and it was red candle, I would have exited, right? And said AVI wrap support not valid now. But if wick rejection and closing above AVI wrap, then wick as a low here that will be closing support going forward. Okay, so that is the answer. Okay, so many private messages. Can I consider this equal to super trend 14 comma three? I don't use super trend. I told you the reason why I'm not using super trend is because, yeah, I don't really. I like to, I like to just take volume into existence whenever I'm doing any kind of analysis on any kind of chart. So I just like to take volume into existence. How do you decide stop loss if we enter 329? What could be the stop loss in that case? Is it 1% on daily basis? In case you enter at 329, which was this particular level. So यहाँ से अगर हमने एक AVI wave plot किया, right? And say if I entered at 329, let's say यहाँ पे हमने enter किया, right? At this candle closing, which is 344. So in that case, my stop loss will be The anchor we wrap at this level, which is 327, because here I got no swing low. If you look at it, right? This candle was high, I got, and I got only one red candle to fall. Right? In such cases, if you don't have two red candles fall, after making a high, I got two red candles to fall. Right? And after making a high, I got only one red candle to fall. So in such cases, what you have to do is you have to keep the stop loss to be. Uh, this particular green line AV wrap, which is 327 minus 1%, 327 minus 1% will be somewhere around 325 on daily closing basis. Your entry is this candle closing, which was 344, and your stop loss is 325 on daily closing basis. 
ओके ए वी वैप पैरामीटर्स जस्ट शो फॉर सिंगल लाइन या वो ए वी वैप मैंने बताया था ना यार देखो जब भी आप प्लॉट कर रहे हो देन यू जस्ट डबल क्लिक ऑन दिस एंड यू नीड टू हाइड द मल्टीप्लायर्स यू आर नॉट इंटरेस्टेड इन मल्टीप्लायर्स यू आर जस्ट इंटरेस्टेड इन द सिंगल लाइन व्हिच इज द वी वैप लाइन नॉट इन द बैंड्स डज दिस वर्क विद हाइकन आशी कैंडल्स आई एम नॉट श्योर आई हैवंट यूज्ड दिस विद हाइकन आशी सो आई वोंट कमेंट ऑन दैट बट यू कैन ट्राई इट आउट विल दिस वर्क सिमिलरली इन इंटरडे ट्रेडिंग यस इट विल I have been personally using Anchor Web App since a very very long time, and I can tell you on that that it it can work in the intraday trading. I won't say it will work. देखो यार कभी भी certainty में बात नहीं करते. We are technical analysts. We deal in probabilities. I won't say it will work. I will say it can and it should work because I have been using it since a long time. So my can is converted into should now. <laughs> we can say volume is important. This. Why did we not plot uh, plot volume in this? Yeah, I have volume hide kar rakha tha just to make charts a bit clear and you know a bit easier for you guys to understand. We can plot volume with this. There is no worries. But this volume weighted average price, which is there, na, its formula is this. Its formula is summation price times volume divided by summation volume, right? So it is taking into account volume. But I just hid volume just to make charts a bit clear and easier to understand for everyone. Can you show AWL chart once again? Sure. So this is a W L chart. One second, yeah, I'm gonna do some layout. I'm gonna open it. Okay. So right now, what you will see is you will see that the stock was immediate resistance. That was at this level, right? Which was this level of. Uh, 769 and from there the stock came right pehle to yahan gaya fir yahan aaya then it made this point then it made a new low at 532 right so from 532 the stock started to bounce right 532 ke level se stock ne meko bounce back dena shuru kiya aur stock ja ja ke ye wale high ke bhi upar nikal gaya to yahan pe pahunch gaya right so my avwap right now is being plotted from 532 एंड वेन एवर द स्टॉक टच इज दिस ए वी वैप आप देखोगे कितना ब्यूटीफुली प्ले किया है इसने जब भी ये स्टॉक ने ए वी वैप को टच किया है यहाँ पे टच किया यहाँ पे टच किया राइट यहाँ पे टच किया एंड टू डेज पहले जब मैंने ये पोस्ट किया था यहाँ पे भी टच किया था और वन परसेंट कैंडल क्लोजिंग नहीं हुई थी ए वी वैप के नीचे दैट इज वेन आई मैंशन अ पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ अ शेक आउट राइट एंड द वेरी नेक्स्ट डे स्टॉक हिट अपर सर्किट सो दैट इवन वैलिडेटेड माई व्यू Right, so that is the chart of AVWA for now. Okay, I think बहुत सारे questions हैं यार. Okay, uh, can you show AWA chart once again? Showed accuracy on five and fifteen minute chart. Mm-hmm. Try it out and you will find it out on your own. Like I said, experience and practice will only give you a hang of it. So मेरे mm-hmm. accuracy part पे बोलने से तुमको इतना confidence नहीं मिलेगा, right? Even if I say it has seventy percent or eighty percent accuracy, you won't get confidence on my words. Until and unless you practice it by yourself. Four eighteen to three fourteen. जाने के बाद three seventy four से two ninety seven तक गया. क्या ये predict कर सकते हैं? Okay, ये मेरे को question थोड़ा confusing लग रहा है. एक बार देख लेते हैं. Four eighteen से three fourteen जाने के बाद three seventy four से two ninety seven तक जाएगा. क्या ये predict कर सकते हैं? ऑनेस्टली यार देखो ये प्रेडिक्ट किया तो जा सकता है क्योंकि जनरली होता क्या है जब भी एक स्टॉक ये वाला लो बनाता है फिर स्टॉक ने ये वाला हाई बनाया तो वेन एवर यू गेट अ ब्रेक डाउन यू जनरली अज्यूम दैट ये वाली जो रेंज है यही वाली रेंज तक स्टॉक नीचे जाएगा सो वी अज्यूम दैट इट विल गो सिक्सटी पॉइंट मोर डाउन बट सिक्सटी पॉइंट मोर डाउन वॉज अ बेट इवन मोर लोअर एंड इट डेड नॉट गो दैट वे सो या आई मीन देर इज अ वे टू प्रेडिक्ट दैट बट दैट्स नॉट दी एजेंट ऑफ टूडे सेशन सो लेट्स जस्ट कीप इट अड फॉर अ वाइट थोड़ा कंफ्यूज हो जाएंगे लोग यार। I have observed that the point where swing high it at yes correct it can be said as a pro tip hammer. Excellent session thank you. How to keep stop loss when using A V W A P alone as single strategy? How to keep stop loss when using A V W A P alone as a single strategy for trading? Uh, uh, when you are using A V W A P as a trading mechanism you know when you are using let's say 5 minute or 15 minute chart 
then you know in that case you should possibly exit on your trigger basis only right kyunki trading mein yaar hum candle closing ka wait nahi kar sakte but still if you are using 5 minute or 15 minute chart just a pro tip main bhi kafi time se use kar raha hu to aap 0.5% candle closing ka wait kar sakte ho below the area for 5 minute or 15 minute chart below the area right how will we identify the false breakout false reversal yaar false breakout false reversal kuch nahi hota ya to breakout hota hai ya breakout nahi hota right there is nothing called false reversal or anything like that there is a possibility of shake out which i particularly told you aur wo shake out ko eliminate karne ke liye we take the 1% in daily 2% in weekly and uh, 2% in monthly right or 0.5% in the 5 minute or 15 minute chart is there any role of volume in this yes i mean avwap and vwap is entirely based on volume and price right so unke formula mein hai price or volume ka role so yeah the volume plays a key role in this but apart from that if you are talking about uh, the volume in that the particular trading script then no not as such because vwap has already accounted price and volume in that so yeah can you check dmart chart yeah stock specific abhi nahi baad mein discuss karenge will avwap correlate with fibonacci moving averages fibonacci moving averages pivot points the uh, avwap can you know you can be used along with that but there is no correlation between the two because uh, fibonacci moving averages and pivot points they take into account only price right and avwap and vwap is taking price as well as volume it can be used for trading options as well ya maine use nahi kiya options ke liye to i won't comment on that but you can try it and find it out will it work on index once again not tried on index yaar i am a full time equity trader to so, meko hai na equity mein trade karna bahut pasand hai i have tried and tested this method on equity and it has worked quite well so i will just say to every one of you that yaar dekho agar mere bolne se koi fark nahi padega if i will tell you that it is working on index if i will tell you it is working on options will you just go tomorrow and start using it no it is not a good idea right you need to practice this particular thing and you need you need to find it out that where is it working well for you right and you need to change the rules accordingly for yourself so you, you just need to try it out practice and get the hang of it how will we identify false breakout yeah false breakout nahi hota i already covered intervals to be set at 5 5 as in i didn't get your question how will we identify are ho gaya false breakout bhai <laughs> how can we use avwap on intraday basis mark avwap at the open candle and yeah intraday basis also you can use it similarly only no i don't have any examples for intraday but uh, like i said abhi ye daily chart ko hai na aap ek bar ke liye intraday wala chart hi assume kar lo hai na ye daily chart ko aap intraday chart assume kar lo let's assume karo ye 5 minute ki candle hai 5 minute ki candle 1 2 3 aise upar gayi fir yahan pe ye wala high banaya right and then it niche aake ye wala low banaya right somewhere hai तो यहीं से आप प्लॉट करोगे ये भी आप जैसे आप नॉर्मल डेली पे कर रहे हो वैसे ही आप फाइव मिनट पे भी करोगे सो देर इज नथिंग डिफरेंट ए वी वैप अदानी बिलमार के साथ में वाई डेड यू नॉट चेंज दैप टू न्यूज थिंग्स आई चेंज डेट एंड शोड यू जस्ट नाउ फाइव मिनट बैक तो ये क्वेश्चन पांच मिनट पुराना है कैन बी प्रेडिक्ट द नेक्स्ट हाई लो फ्रॉम current level can we predict the next high now from current levels yes you can for that you need to watch the session uh, google drive link mein abhi dal dunga excellent session thank you thank you google drive ka link mein chalo yaar share kar deta hu okay so that was all from our today session and uh, the recording of today session will be uploaded on the google drive link the recording will also be uploaded and posted on my socials so i will just post the socials link in the chat box with everyone these are my socials you can connect with me on the following phone numbers and email and the google drive link i will just share with you in the chat box google drive link is this so what you can do is you can you just save my number you can save my email and you can also connect with me on socials after the session if you have any questions the google drive link is posted in the chat box aaj ki recording mein youtube pe upload kar dunga i will also post on twitter as well as my linkedin and i will also post on the whatsapp groups which you are part of jahan se tumko ye link mila okay so i hope all of you enjoyed today's sessions and you learned something new which you might want to use going forward or you might like using going forward do let me know your experience how you felt it with avwap and 
if it helped in any way with your trading okay so chalo i hope all of you have a great sunday ahead and once again thank you for joining in have a wonderful day